Do you like fantasy movies? We've compiled our top movies choice, and you should watch them. Both married. I'm sure being adrift in space gives you a hall pass. Top 7 Romantic Comedies of 2023. I lost his number, but I need to find this guy that I met on the plane. Sounds really stupid. Sounds brave. I need to see this through, whatever it is. You mean like with you and the groom? I mean, we can just call him Sean. She came up with the story, my talent wrote the music. I mean, you don't kill men and eat them, do you? No, <laughs> I haven't yet. Number 7. Sorry, I wasn't looking at ours. Robots 2023. Robots depicts the tale of human life, demonstrating how robotic technology may build androids that are extremely similar to their human owners. As a result, it is not unexpected that many owners slash masters rely on their android devices to perform daily tasks. And because they are so identical, it's no surprise that others frequently confuse the real master with the robot. Um, two cappuccinos. Thank you. You guys don't understand. They're not going to be obedient anymore. That's not fair. Number six. Good dog. Mm -hmm. I was thinking tonight could be a good night for a sex night, possibly. She came to me 2023. She Came to Me, starring Peter Dinklage as Stephen Laudem, Marissa Tomei as Katrina, Joanna Kulig as Magdalena, Brian Darcy James as Trey, and Anne Hathaway as Patricia, Stephen's wife, tells the story of a music composer who experiences creative block and is unable to come up with ideas for his greatest opera performance. Stephen Lau Dem, a New York City resident suffering from creativity block, must put together a presentation for his comeback. However, he ran out of ideas due to creative block. As a result, he did not receive any inspiration. I imagine getting inside their heads with disinfectant and just scrubbing them down. I mean, you don't kill men and eat them, do you? No, <laughs> well, I haven't yet. You know I can't resist or Number matters. five. Somebody I Used to Know 2023. Somebody I Used to Know follows the story of ally, Alison Brie, who abandoned her lover and homeland in a small village a decade ago. Ally, who is experiencing a setback in her job as a TV producer, chooses to return to her birthplace to find solace. She reunites with her ex-boyfriend, Sean, J. Ellis, and spends the night reminiscing about their previous relationship. She begins to rethink everything in the past, especially her decision to leave Sean. When Ale learns that Sean is marrying Cassidy, Kiersey Clemens, things become even more confused. Keep your eyes on the iPad. Bradley Pitt Campbell, do not sit up. Number four. A trillion dollars trying to get one dude back from Mars. If you get the opportunity to bring back Matt Damon. If you were the last 2023. If you were the last will be available on March 11th, 2023. Depth of Field, Pinky Promise, and Storm City Films present If You Were the Last, which falls under the romance and science fiction genres. If You Were the Last stars Missy Pyle, Natalie Morales, and Anthony Mackle, all of whom are exceptional actors. Adrift in their damaged space shuttle, two astronauts debate whether they would rather spend their remaining days as friends or anything more. Oh. We're not attracted now, but we would emotionally attach. You may fall in love. Number three. On a typical day at John F. Kennedy Airport, there are thousands of people going hundreds of places. Excuse me, sorry. Love at First Sight 2023. Love at First Sight is the latest romantic comedy film that depicts the story of two people who fell in love at first sight but are later separated by fate. The film follows Hadley Sullivan, Haley Lou Richardson, a US citizen, and Oliver Jones, Ben Hardy, a British citizen, who meet for the first time in an airport. Hadley Sullivan, 20, arrived at the check-in location late and was unable to board on time due to a scheduling error. He had intended to go to London to attend his father's wedding. 
Hadley had to order a new ticket for the next flight, and only business class tickets were available. Good. Tech bro or? I'm studying statistics at Yale. Subtle status drop there. <laughs> British, you know, I can't help myself. <laughs> Number two. Hey, head of the wedding. Of my sister? Yes, I am. So where's your fiance? Wait, is this him? Anyone but you 2023. According to the IMDb profile, the film Anyone But You is about two people who go on an unbelievable first date. However, their relationship ended after that, and they met again some months later. It all began when B. Sidney Sweeney visited a coffee shop. There, he meets Ben, Glenn Powell, an employee of Goldman Sachs. Both of them were immediately drawn to each other. They spent time together at Ben's home. B then discreetly leaves Ben. However, he felt horrible and returned there, only to hear Ben disparage him to his friend Pete Gatta. Jonathan, my parents have been trying to get us back together. He's like a son to us. Maybe we should just tell everyone we're together. What? It would solve that Number problem. one. Stop! Gary! Court order for asset seizures. So they're taking my car? You went radio silent on me. No Hard Feelings 2023. No Hard Feelings is Jennifer Lawrence's latest comedy film, co-starring Andrew Barth Feldman. The video depicts an unusual romance between a woman and an antisocial youngster. No Hard Feeling combines comedy and romance as Maddie Barker, Jennifer Lawrence, fulfills Percy Becker's parents, Andrew Barth Feldman, mission to date their son. Gene Stupnitsky wrote and directed the picture No Hard Feelings, and he co-authored the screenplay with John Phillips. Jennifer Lawrence is not only the lead actor, but also the producer. This picture, which had a budget of $45 million, was released in the United States on June 23rd. Really sweet. The best part about getting older is not giving a fuck what people think. Get away from her! Stay. <laughs> my house. You think I chose this? Look at this. Need a car? Date our son this summer. No, I've heard of it. You know, we tried everything to bring him out of his shell. He doesn't come out of his room. He doesn't talk to girls. He doesn't drink. So when you say date him, do you mean what you got down there? Something for me? <laughs> Why? You think skinny dipping. What about sharks? Men here. Jellyfish? Not this season. It's really the lack of lifeguards. Let's get the fuck in here right now. This is the order of the AW Charge version. I hope you are interested in watching it and don't forget to leave a mark on this channel by liking and subscribing. Thank you.